I'm here with my Nesco four quart roaster oven and I am going to be roasting some chicken leg quarters. Counter cooking. No kitchen, no problem. So I had a two pack of these chicken leg quarters. They look really big to me. These are really big thighs with the drumsticks attached and I thought I would roast them in my roaster. So here they are. I'm not using a roaster rack in the bottom because with this roaster, the heating element is all around the sides of the roaster. There's no heating element on the bottom. So I'm curious to see how it comes out without putting a roasting rack in it. So the roaster's plugged in and I am going to set the temperature to 400 degrees. I just put it on and I'm gonna cover it and there's the roaster oven. I'm going to set a timer for a half hour. We'll be back in a half hour, we'll check on the chicken. It's about a half hour later. Let's open this up and see what's going on. I hear a lot of cooking inside. So that's what it looks like. I'm wondering if I should turn the chickens over. Let's see what's going on in there. I wanted to see what the bottoms looked like because the bottom of this is not supposed to get hot and as we can see the bottom is not browned, it didn't really stick. There was a little sticking on the sides but that would indicate that the sides are what's getting really hot. So let's put the cover back on and I'm going to cook these for another half hour. This is what the chicken looks like after another half hour. I wish you could smell how good this smells. It smells really good. So I just turned the heat off and I'm going to put the lid back on. I'm going to let the chicken just kind of sit here for, I don't know, like 10 or 15 minutes. I'm just going to let it rest and then I'll come back and we'll cut into it and take a look at what's going on inside. So here is the roasted chicken. We can see that the meat has been pulling away from the bone on the drumstick. And then here's the thigh. It looked like all the juices were running clear, but let's just cut into it and make sure it is cooked thoroughly. And there it is, everything's looking good. And um, this is what the other side's looking like. I do see a little bit of, of pink here, but this is the dark meat, and sometimes dark meat by the bone is a, a little almost pink. Yeah, that's cooked all the way through. I'm not seeing any, there's no red juices or anything. Obviously, if you're very concerned about those kinds of things, you can always use a meat thermometer. So I had the four quart roaster oven set to 400 degrees, and I think an hour is a good amount of time at 400 degrees. And so that's how easy it is to make some roasted chicken in the Nesco four quart roaster oven. I hope this video was helpful for you. Thanks for watching. Bye.